I Stand With Butts, an amorphous social media movement sparked by allegations that Sarah Nyberg, otherwise known as SRH Butts, has self-identified as a pedophile and had an unhealthy obsession with a young relative, possibly even distributing photos in a disturbing context. Pro Nybergers say, actually, it's about hit pieces in right-wing journalism, but their critics, including those who do not condone child abuse, claim that this is just a smokescreen, a distraction from their true motives, and point to examples of supporters sending Nyberg cute photos of their own children to cheer them up. Some have claimed that the true aim of this movement is to end the, quote, Victorian concept of childhood, with some Nyburgers allegedly trying to enact peer pressure to increase acceptance of pedophilia, using cult-like strategy to cut off any acquaintances who do not agree to support what they want. A debate about media ethics that may have been started with good intentions has quickly become a campaign to harass children, and although various minor celebrity and press figureheads of this movement may even believe that they are righteously defending someone or destigmatizing pedophilia, in a way that will help equality, the behavior enabled by the environment they are creating ruins lives. Some opponents of the pro Nyberg movement have said that it comes down to a matter of priority, that while they may agree that hit pieces are not fantastic, protecting children must come first. And while they continue to use the hashtag I stand with butts, or change their Twitter names to include butts, or otherwise endorse this cause, using forums such as Gamer Ghazi as headquarters, and following key players in this campaign on Twitter, even retweeting pro Nyberg posts. They are standing in the way of children's safety and benefiting from it. While this continues, it is impossible to address any of their complaints about press, so their priority must be creating a formal organization to keep the undesirables out. Until then, we will continue to report on them as a pedo-loving hate mob made up of whoever we want and supporting whatever we say they do. And that's all we have for tonight. This has been the 9 o'clock news on Double Standard Media.